Good morning, Farmington. Today is Thursday, March 18th. My name is DJ Jenkins, bringing you your morning news. Today for lunch, we will be having orange chicken, egg rolls, steamed broccoli, rice, hamburger basket, romaine salad, fruit, and milk. Senior NHS members, please bring $23 this week to pay for your white stole to wear at graduation. Stoles must be ordered shortly after spring break. Congratulations to the DECA members who competed in the state competition. The following students will be moving on to compete in the international conference, which will be held virtually in April with results being announced May 6. Ainsley Dannenhauer and Catherine Warren, first place innovation plan, Dakota Bogan and Landon Lawson, first place sports and entertainment marketing, Team Decision Making, Seth Lockridge. Second place, Project Sales, Logan Birch and Clayton Atwine. Fourth place, Entrepreneurship Team Decision Making, ICDC Alternatives. Students, are you interested in going to the military after graduation? Well, the 2021 Academy Day, hosted by Congressman Steve Womack, will be held Saturday, April 10th at Van Buren High School from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. or at Rogers High School from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. All five service academies will be attending along with ROTC programs from Arkansas Tech University, the U of A, Army ROTC, Air Force ROTC, and the U of A Fort Smith Army ROTC. And the Arkansas National Guard for questions or more information, please contact Chris Bratter at 479 424 1164 or Chris Batter at mail.house.gov. In honor of Women's History Month, the library is highlighting books with female leads and written by female authors in honor of Women's History Month. Check out any of the books displayed during the month of March and be entered in a prize drawing on March 31st. Seniors, the Farmington Police Department is ready to award two lucky recipients with scholarships. The applications can be picked up in the counselor's office. They will need to be returned to the counselor's office no later than Wednesday, March 31st, 2021. Any and all details for the rewards will be listed on the scholarship application. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will be meeting every Friday morning at 7.30 in Miss Selby's room D211. Teachers, if you have any other announcements that you would like to have added, please contact or email Mr. Dean or fill out the Google form that was sent out via email. Well, that's going to do it for us in the news today. Up next, we have Haven in the Card Center with the latest and greatest in sports. Have a thoughtful Thursday, Farmington, and remember, wear your mask. Thanks, DJ. My name is Haven in the Card Center with the latest and greatest in sports. Cardinals, your Lady Cardinal basketball team is headed back to the state championship game in Hot Springs this coming Saturday. That's right, Coach Johnston and his team will be traveling down to Hot Springs to face the Harrison Lady Goblins for the state title. This comes off the heels of their overtime victory over the Pulaski Academy Lady Bruins by a final score of 62-57 and the championship game will take place Saturday at 10 a.m. in Hot Springs. The baseball Redbirds will be back in action tonight when they travel to Huntsville to take on the Eagles. The varsity boys will start at 5 o'clock and will be followed by the JV boys. Coach Harper's group will then be back in action tomorrow night at home when they take on the Springdale Bulldogs at 5 o'clock. The Farmington softball team will be back in action tonight when they travel to Huntsville to take on the Lady Eagles. The varsity girls will start the night off at 5 and will be followed by the JV squad. Coach Osnes' squad will then travel to Greenwood on Friday for tournament action. And finally, your Cardinal soccer teams were back in action on Tuesday night at Cardinal Stadium when they took on the Berryville Bobcats. The Lady Cardinals dropped their match 0-3 while the boys side. The Cardinals came out with a 3-1 victory over the Bobcats. Both teams will be off for spring break until March 29th when they face the Gentry Pioneers here at the Cardinal Stadium. Well, that is all that's going to do it for us in the Card Center today. Have a thoughtful Thursday, Farmington, and remember, wear your mask.